god. No, give me lands. This... Alright, now you're good. We're, ship we're keeping this, and it's really bad, but we're keeping it. You're gonna love your top deck. You're gonna love the way you look. Hey, mm. welcome back. Welcome back to the stack. Welcome back. If you've been here before, my name is... Someone's cooking something in the background. Actually, sh I didn't think about that until literally the second we went live. <laughs> Wait, we're going, we're live? I don't think we're live right now. Time up. We're fine. Come on, come on. Jesus. <laughs> Just slam the door. I, I love it. Am I frustrated? What? Am I frustrating you? No. Because sometimes I get the sense that like, no. the, way, the way like, the, the intonation of some things you say. Colin, um, no. When we have to take a vacation to wait for our turn, yes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, but you're fine. So, like... Someone off camera said something. We're playing Magic the Gathering <laughs> today. High power stuff. There is a new commander here, and then there's a bunch of other commanders. Check that out. I'm gonna talk about my commander now, which means you gotta hit the play, the, 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 the thing with the commander. Four. Look at this. I'm player four because this is Commodore Guff. Commodore Guff is a Jeskai Planeswalker commander that says at the beginning of your end step, you put a loyalty count on another Planeswalker. He makes a 1-1 one, one wizard that can add mana for Planeswalkers, and then he can burn the board and draw you cards where X is the Planeswalkers you control. He's all about having Planeswalkers in play. That's it. That's the deck. It's Jeskai. I wish there was black because I miss Aminatu. I really miss Aminatu. Hey, do you miss Aminatu? I actually do have this Aminatu. It was my like one of my first decks that I ever built when I got back into Magic. Is this um, an Aminatu? No, it's not. This is Mono Black Reanimator. Um, I'm going to be using Brave's ability to try and generate value um, and hopefully get a lot of mana and try and finish things out either with a Velocity Citadel combo or like an Exsanguinate or something like that. Um, Hell yeah. But otherwise, it's just Reanimator. I'm just trying to generate that. Oh, Coco Show. And uh, Gary, Green Merchant and Merchant. Or uh, whatever he is. Yeah, just... yeah, yeah. I'm X just... Burn Spells. Yeah. What, is that an X burn spell over there, Chris? Uh, no, this is a mana dork. So we're just playing big green idiots because I'm a Timmy and I like to play big green idiots. Hell and yeah, bro. This guy, girl, person uh, makes mana and can cast creatures. And when that cast creature power five or good, she gets a counter untapped herself. Oh, shit. And she makes two mana. She's like a worn power stone, but like on steroids. It's great. Speaking of steroids, is this a worn power stone on steroids? This is a an oldie but a goodie. You might remember from like three years ago, back when that cassette came out. New Cabana, we had Jetmir Nexus of Rebels. He's the um, he's the go wide ran, uh, overrun on a stick. He you, you got a lot of dudes that get plus three plus zero and double strike and trample and vigilance and uh, fuck your face. Wow, hooray! Fucking the face. Here's Articuno. Okay. Here's an energy. Here's an oh, energy. am I allowed to swear? Oh, it's after the first minute, probably. We pro hopefully. If it's, I, if, listen, we'll bleep it out. Yeah, easy. You well. just looked at it. <laughs> you just, you just did three, uh, two, one. Hey, thanks. Wow, <laughs> I didn't know what this was. That's fair. <laughs> it could have been anything. It could have been anything. All right, all right, all right. We're good. Yeah, we got we're, stuff. We got, we're good. Chris, send, send us to this. Don't fucking do that, buddy. <laughs> Contact. <laughs> okay, draw. Land for turn. Uh, here's a new one, Delighted Halfling. Ooh. Nice. Ooh. Naughty. Adds colorless or adds a man of any color to cast legendary spells and they can't be countered. I drew a card. Bomb pass. Whoa. I get it. No way. Uh, I'm gonna play Polluted Delta. Whoa. Uh, I'm gonna crack Polluted Delta. Do you have it? No. Cool. Uh, fuck. Uh, duck. I'm just gonna like present no threat at all. Where is my triumph? I want my triumph. Triumph, triumph, triumph. Triumph. Oh my god, I closed the door because May was cooking stuff and now it's getting hot in here. Triumph. <laughs> triumph. There it is. All right. We did it. Ragger and triumph. It does everything that I want later. Pass the turn. All right. I'll just draw a card. And uh, now that Chris ruined my plans of manatizing his commander with this delighted half thing, I guess I'll just cast an Esper set, though. <laughs> How's that go? Get wrecked, loser. Uh, I'm going to draw a card. Uh, here's a land. And then here's me casting my commander. Uncounterable. Wow. Crazy. Damn. Go ahead. S -s Subtlety. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> that would have been amazing. I'd be really sad. Here's a swamp guy. Yeah, you may draw a card when I play this jet medallion. Hell yeah, brother. Go ahead. Untap, upkeep, we're gonna draw a card. Uh, we are going to play a planes, and guy, guess what? You get to draw another card. <gasps> yeah. Here's a Boro Sigma. Yeah. Just yeah. Feeding him? <laughs> I, I gotta develop. I'm hungry. We're going to pass turn. <laughs> hungry, hungry, hippos. 
Uh, Kidoki. I'm going to play this rock fall, rock fall bail. And I need to read this because I never remember how these works. So it enters the battlefield tapped unless I control two or more other lands. We're done. Wait. Wait. Get him. Nah. Nah. What? We're all friends here. Just keep casting those spells, buddies. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You got, you got, got it. it. <laughs> That's what didn't do anything wrong. Untap. Upkeep. I'm going to draw on my hands upside down, but that's okay because I drew a magic card. Here's a land. Uh, here is for six um, a regal behemoth. Uh, Gwena will untap. Ooh. I am the monarch. Huh. Nice. Woo! Can I have a dice? Sure. Uh, so this represents that Gwena has a counter, and what represents the monarchy? I'll get you that in a second. My hand. Your hand? Okay. This is the monarchy. <laughs> Just so you guys are aware. Um, and honestly, Con want a blocker just in case something dies. So I'm just going to pass. And yeah. then I draw for the monarchy. There you go. Wow. It's yeah. crazy. Uh, here's a swamp. Let me think about my life. Great. I thought about it. Uh, yeah, for two, we're going to play raids. Nice. Actually right there. Monarchy. Ooh. Um, guy. Yeah, buddy. Guess what? Hell yeah. I'm gonna play a Fuck. Oh yeah. All right. I'll draw a card. Uh, and we're gonna move my end step. Yeah. I'm going to sacrifice a skull plan. Uh, everyone uh, may sacrifice an artifact or lose two, and I draw a card. I do not have an artifact. I'm gonna lose. I got two. your back, boy. I'm gonna draw three. Dang, that's so good. Go ahead. Three, eight. Actually, I lied. I'm gonna discard a Coco Shell. I'm sure that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> What's the worst that's gonna happen? I'm here to fucking die. I don't have a land drop. Uh, we're gonna tap three. Guess who gets to draw a card? Here's an honor worn <laughs> shock. This Man. Esper Sentinel is. Doom work. Pass the turn. This is like the best Esper Sentinel I've ever seen because right. no one's <laughs> respecting it. It's fine. Don't I, worry about it. I don't pay my taxes. Um, let's play a tapped Kibira takedown, but it's actually Kibira Plateau. Do I want to do that? Maybe I want to not move to discard. So let's play a Sundown Pass. And let's play Brimass. There he is. Oh, dang. Just a cool just a cool dude. He's just a cool dude. Um, I'm done. All right. On tap. Upkeep. I'm going to draw a magic card. I still have to discard shit. Uh, we'll play a land. So all of our lands and additional mana because of Regal Behemoth, since I am the Monarch. Um... So, I'm gonna tap for nine mana. Nine. Making colors. So, eight from my lands, one from Delight of Halfling. Um, you can't defend this. Here you go. Cool. Invasion of Ikoria. I'm gonna go search my library for a creature with CMC X or less and put it in the battlefield. It has to be a non human. It's not a human, I promise. Cool. Seven. The it's, CMC is seven. CMC is seven. All right. I know what you're thinking. Well, Chris, what are you grabbing for seven? That would be really good here. Well, there's a couple of options. Mm -hmm. uh, I thought about mm -hmm. old Nawbone, because Nawbone's hilarious, but I already got a lot of mana. So instead, I'm just gonna grab this Regal Force. That makes perfect sense. And then when it enters the battlefield, I'll draw a card for each green creature I control, which is four. Nice! So what does this thing do when you when you beat it up? Uh, it flips into a... Oh, just an 8-8. Eight eight eight. Eight. Just an 8-8. Eight eight. Just an 8-8. Eight eight. No with, with reach and for each non-human creature you control, you may have that creature sign its combat damage as though it weren't blocked. Yeah, so you basically just can't block so, my so idiots. All of them. Yeah. So it's normal. Shuffle that. This guy enters. I'm gonna draw my four magic to gathering cards uh, after I stop cheating. Um, oh, did you pay for Esper something? You can have one. Hell yeah. Everybody's let you draw one. I'll let you draw one. Fine. <laughs> uh, then I'm going to. Move to combat, and we're going to kill, kill the invasion. Well, you killed my your invasion. That <laughs> yeah. So now he gets, you get the Zil Zil Zilortha Apex of Icoria. Thank God you're here. Yeah, it's an eight-eight with reach. I was gonna struggle through that real hard. Um, and then after that, I'm simply just going to pass a turn, draw a card, and discard to hand size. Right. Well, nice. Check it out. I'm gonna play a Cabal Coffers. Fuck yeah. That's good. I think it might be time to start paying taxes. <laughs> Maybe. 
Maybe? I can't see any reason not to. <laughs> it's, it's, too, it's too late now. <laughs> it's kind of too late now. Just keep going. <laughs> it, it's it's just, you can only draw one card. The the IRS can't stop you now. Um, we're going to add four black to my mana pool. Okay. Okay. Is it four? Yeah. yeah. Yep. Right. Wait. No, it'd be oh. three. This is this is three. It's two and then three and then add this one. Got it. Hell yeah. The extra it's swamp pass for mana. All right, we're gonna use two to animate dead. We're gonna. You gonna pay the one? Yeah. Okay. It's 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 one last color jet medallion, but then we're gonna animate Coco Show. Coco Show's in play. I have two mana left over. Yep. You do. You know what? I guess I didn't need this one. I guess I only didn't. need to pay it once. Yep. Yeah. It's fine. Uh, we're gonna play a Vat of Reaper. What is that? That's a good one. Uh, whenever another artifact or creature I control is put into a graveyard from the battlefield, the oil counter it, pay three and tap it, only as a sorcery to reanimate a creature and remove four. Remove four oil counters and reanimate a creature. I get it. We're going to move to my end step where we're going to sacrifice animate dead. Hell yeah. Uh, you can sacrifice an enchantment or lose two and I draw a card. Also, nice. Tokucho is going to die. We're going to pull oil counter and you're all going to lose five and I'm going to gain 15. Wow. Hell yeah. <laughs> Amazing. Rude. All right, Eight. Calvin, you can pop off now. I. <laughs> <laughs> um, we're going to get him. Spin. It wouldn't be a stack video if someone did it. Make right? A, make a mess in your room. <laughs> we're gonna. By all uh, means. We're gonna bet a Witch King of Angmar. Ooh. I don't know what that means. I don't either. I never played it. <laughs> a new edition. Untap, upkeep, supreme predict? No. Um. Hey. How could you? How could you? want a supreme verdict man i don't see I, the problem here you know i'm just playing magic i'm just gonna die aren't i yeah nice you have to pay for your sins sins from a game before that's bad uh, etiquette when i'm so far behind already i'm not gonna i'm not gonna swing it you don't even have creatures that's true it's interesting math we're gonna play a dark our waste this is my land for turn mm -hmm. uh, Stinky. Everything is poopy stinky. I'm, right. really, I'm really digging your planes. Hmm? That your planes? My planes? My Doctor Who planes? That's pretty cool. I like it. Lose a life with Dark Car Waste. Okay. Uh, and then we'll do that and that. I'm gonna play Jace Architect of Thought. Hell yeah. Uh, yeah. The, the, the oldie but a goodie. Are you gonna pay one? No. Hell yeah. Just kill me. No. <laughs> Uh, we're going to reveal the top three cards in my library, and opponent separates those cards into two piles. Put one of those piles into my hand, and the other is at the bottom of my library. Uh, and I reveal them. So here you go, guy. There you go. <laughs> nice. Thank you. Manifold. We've all been going to discard like every turn. I, I want you to. I want you to partake in the throwing <laughs> things away. To game. Discard. Uh, we're not going to do this hot tap where we pass and die. Untap and draw. You, you did represent a blasphemous act to me, which I kind of have to deal with that. Do you have trample? He uh, has no, but I have super trample. Effectively unblockable. Hmm. Like you can deal can damage to it, but he'll just ignore you and kill whatever he wants. Let's go. It's a good time. It's two a time. for a Boro Signet. Yep. And then two for a Slesnia Signet. Dang. Yeah. Ain't, ain't that cool. Ain't that neat. And then, uh, I may as well head to combat. And uh, I've assessed the board. And I think I won't. <laughs> you know what, Foley? Yeah. I'm going to attack you. Sure. <laughs> With my Vigilance 3 4. Uh, trigger, I make a 1 1. You, he can block the 1 1. I, oh. You I'll, block, block, you? I'll block the 1 1. Got him. <laughs> so he, takes, he takes 3. All right. Good, good job, everybody. Good game. Um, I'm all set. All right, I'll untap, upkeep, I'll draw. So here's another forest, shocking. Um, I'm gonna tap Delighted Halfling for a colorless. Here's a soul ring. Do you pay it? We'll pay it. That's right. Leaving, leaving a green floating. Uh, leaving a green floating for what? This, because it makes two, because it's uh, Regal Behemoth. Wow. Yep. So I still have a green floating. Here's a, here's an Emerald Medallion. So two, four, six. Tap four, six. Uh, we're going to cast a Zopandril, Hunger Dominus. Wow, I hate that. It's got reach. At the beginning of each combat, double the power and toughness of each creature I control until uh, end of turn. Nice. That's a problem. Uh, and then I can pay two Phyrexian Green, sacrifice two creatures to give him Indestructible. 
Um, cool. And then I'm gonna cast this three visits to go find a, a forest. I have a green floating. Yes. Uh, I'm not gonna do anything with that green. I'm just gonna simply move to combat. So now these are all doubled. Nice. It's a sweet 16-16 out there. Yeah, he's a 16-16. He's a 10-10. He's a 10-10. This is a six seven. Six seven, yes. Um, so the correct option is probably to just not get blown up by the blast from the sack. But interesting. I mean, the guy yeah. you just play can become indestructible, right? Yeah. So that's why I'm probably I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna spread around the love. So uh, Foley, here's a sixteen yeah. sixteen. Uh, guy, here's a ten ten. Calvin, here's a 10 10. Chase or him? Uh, you. That's fine. That 10 10 has trample, I assume? It has uh, super yeah, trample. It has, it has trample and it has this. 21's a cool number. One day. There we go. And then after wow. that. Oh, I guess I do have this guy. I'll just leave him back. Um, yeah, you don't want to lose the Monarch. Yeah, you, you know. <laughs> I could take it from you right now. You could. Think about that. Yeah, you could. I'll pass turn after that, and I'll right. draw for the monarchy. Hey, Chris, do any of your creatures have hex proof? No. Okay. Uh, made of it. Yeah. Great. That's uh, a great one. Uh, we're going to add three. Yep. And then four. I don't know if I need that four, but we'll, find, we'll figure it out. We are going to need that four. Yeah. Uh, we're going to victimize. Uh, we're going to sacrifice. Oh, I'm okay. paying for it. Damn it. We're going to sacrifice braids out of oil counter here, and we're going to target which king of well, Agmar. Don't you, you don't need to tap that then, right? Because it costs I don't two. Gonna, huh? I have another thing I'm going to do. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. No, you're good. Uh, Kokosho and witch king of Agmar. Right. I don't think this witch king is going to attack, but what it does is whenever more, one or more creatures, I can. Uh, whenever one or more creatures deal combat damage to each opponent, or to me, each opponent sacrifices a creature that dealt combat to me this turn, and then mm -hmm. the ring to me. Very, okay. Very good. Cool. So those come back I tapped, can, right? Uh, is that what? Yes, that is what that does. I can read cards. I promise. Nice. Uh, anyway, we're gonna use that one floating black to cast Diabolic Intent on Coco Show. Yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. We're all, everyone's gonna lose five. I'm gonna gain fifteen, and then I'm gonna go find a card. He just got the life back. Why don't you? Why don't you do something about that over there? Uh, leave 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 Calvin and I out of this. We'll play our own little mini game. <laughs> you go kill him. Holy, can you do something about Chris? <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry about Calvin and I. We're just doing our own little thing. That'd, that'd, be, that'd be cool. Uh, this will be the card that I get. I won't tell. And then uh, after that, go ahead. Oh, another creature died. Well, I'm definitely getting Blasphemy Sacked, so. <laughs> dum, 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 dum. Untap, upkeep, draw. Oh boy, I'm at 14. Uh, we're gonna We're gonna start things off. We're gonna start things off by adding one to my mana pool. Yep. Okay. Then I'm going to tap an untapped legendary permanent I control in order to untap it. That's beautiful. Whoa. And then I'm going to minus two J's. <laughs> so we have one floating, everyone. That was the idea. One floating. Colorless. colorless. It's colorless. Okay. One, two, three. Here you go. Oh. Gave it to the Foley. Hey. That's a signal. That's that. Those are Magic the Gathering cards he did a thing about, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. All right. He's like, don't you want this juicy, saucy, fucking spark double in your hand? Oh. Ooh. Foley wants to cast a spell that he doesn't want countered. And it, not necessarily. And it may or may not be a non-creature spell. There's no way to know for sure. It's not like he hasn't been re reanimating every single turn. Yeah. I mean, like, <laughs> <laughs> so like and he didn't just tutor last turn. You don't need the lands. You're actually correct. I don't. I know this because I gave them to you. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen your hand. <laughs> oh, brother. Oh, brother. Oh. Or, here's the thing. Okay. What if we have other counter magic in our hand? All right. What if? What if? Hear, hear him out. So we'll just take this and see what we can do. I'm putting the Dovin's video at the bottom. Because so it's, it's not like he can counter my counter. Oh. Like, what's the blue? Oh. Yeah, actually, yeah. I, Black doesn't play counter spells. Hey, no, absolutely. M. Smith Schiff. Yeah, for sure. I don't have one yet, actually. Okay. You should get one. I, I plan on it. Land for turn is Command Tower. That's gonna help. Juicy. There's also Dash Hopes. There's Dash Hopes? 
pay five life or dispel this counter. Isn't there another one where like so you you take an extra turn? Yeah, or something you, like that. Yeah, but you lose half your life. Oh. Seems fine. Everything yeah, it deals like a bunch. It's like four black and it like deals a bunch of damage to you, and then you take an extra turn. That has five power. This has five power. I also uh, there's a second line of test that says discard a card, which painting of Angmar and gains into circle the under dark. Very, very nice. For what it's worth, this was supposed to. I guess this was supposed to untap when I casted this, so it should just have one more counter. Sure. Doesn't think it's gonna matter because it's gonna get board wiped. But uh, I forgot these do get cast. Oh yeah, that's right. It's kind of weird. Yeah, it also means that they're really bad against Minute Fairy because you can't cast them. Oh. Yeah, it's rude. <laughs> Minute Fairy pe peeing in everyone's soup. Once again. Once again. We tap. That's much more. One, two, three, so four, five, six. Six in total. Here's Teferi Temporal Archmage. Go ahead, buddy. Yeah! Why'd you tap? <laughs> uh, he was excited. But, no, that's fair. We now get to untap four permanents, because we're going to mine it. So we're going to untap these permanents. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to do yeah. this. Yeah. We're going to tap Teferi to untap the Shuku. I love that stupid trick. We're, we're thinking with portals now. <laughs> Then that card looks like it fell out of Yu a Yu-Gi-Oh set. Yes. <laughs> Tap like that. Let's get this uh, Spark Double. Spark Double into play. Wow. Which is a copy of the Teferi. I'm assuming this is going to continue on forever. We're just an infinite loop. We're, yeah. No, this isn't legendary. That's what that's worth. So I can't actually use this to get a mana. Uh, so yeah, he enters actually with six counters. But he can untap the other Teferi. Uh, look, he can untap the other Teferi. <laughs> We're just doing this. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Untap your Teferi. Come on. Don't you want to say it? Say the words. Say it. <laughs> then we're going to... Uh, this guy gives me a red and a white. Here is my blue. And then a, another. Commodore Guff. Yep. Commodore. Uh... We really wanted to get there, Commodore Guff, uh, which now we can use Commodore Guff. We'll just do that now. Ta-da. Ah. And before fucking anything else happens, last one's act. Boom. We are going to discard a swamp to make him indestructible. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna activate Gwena to get two mana, and I'm gonna use the Pandrel. Yep. So I will sacrifice. Um, I don't think it matters. So we'll just act these two. These are dead. The so Pandrel is indestructible. Yep. I have no recourse. This is back in the command zone. Oh, this is still out. These are dead. Yay. Now we properly took them up in order to make a 1-1 that can tap from him. And then we are going to pass the turn. Untap and draw. Let's start off by one, two, three, four, five, six. Hmm. So he, he can he can minus X to minus three. It'll do damage equal to each of you, and I'll draw a number of cards equal to the number of walkers I have. Us, not yeah. not a target. target. Got it. Um, I'll play a planes. I'll move to discard. <laughs> oh no. And let's uh I don't like that. Let's put this Kabir plateau away. We don't need this anymore. Alright. I'm not scared at all. You're scared. What? Who's what's scared? What? What? So I'm gonna untap. Nervously. I'm gonna draw. Nervously. The, the, uh, the night deck's holding up mana. What are we gonna do? He could do anything. He could do anything. Honestly, I don't know what you're gonna do, and that scared me more. He could oh, have. I'm gonna play the Microsoft Garden. Seven mana tithes. <laughs> Um. Then I'm going to. For three mana. Oh, this has an indestructible counter on it. Can I borrow Peach or something? Yeah, here's, here's your, your counter. There you um, go. She's indestructible. She is indestructible. Can't be, can't be defeated. Um, I'm gonna tap for three. Here's a questing beast. Wait, can I see this? Yeah. 
Wow. Don't try to read it. It has it'll, haze it'll, it'll just does hurt. other things, right? Can't be blocked by creatures with power two or less. Combat damage that you would be dealt to creatures control can't be prevented. Whenever he deals combat damage to an opponent, it deals that much damage to her target plants work that player's controls. And at the beginning of your upkeep, draw a card. At the beginning of your end step, create a token. Sorry, Vegas. I'm going to lose a life and arcane denial that. Well, okay. Uh, Yay. I'll play an old knob on. Yay. Oh my god. Oh, get baited. Um, so I'm gonna move to combat. Yay. Triggers a pandrel. He's an 8-6. Uh -huh. I mean, 8, uh -huh. whatever. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh, I can't swing you because you can block it. So, yeah, you have the most life. So, uh, I guess you could turn it back. Unless you attack me and I go to block, he should do that anyways because you're gonna get a bunch of treasures. Yeah, so I guess it doesn't matter. Whatever. I'll just swing it. And then untap it. Yep. Ta da! And that's it. Wow. I'll draw a card from Marky. Cool. That's, I'll draw that's two still at the there. Wow. Uh, we're going to play a swamp. We're going to try and play a dual notice. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. This is now one, two, three, four uh, black. Yep. Which actually just, hang on. <laughs> okay. Wait. I right. have a lot of mana now. Hang on. Oh, he's doing a thinky. <laughs> I'm doing a thinky thunk. I think maybe we should kill some of those planeswalkers. Because there's two Teferis. <laughs> no. When has Teferi ever been a problem? Um, <laughs> okay. So we're going to crack the Jeweled Lotus. And we just need one extra. Yeah, we just need one extra swamp. We're going to play Braids. Here's your Braid. Um, this is your mind on Braids. Uh, for, <laughs> for black mana, we're going to use two to cast Lightning Greaves. Fast Braids. Lightning Breeze. Okay. And then we're going to go out trying to equip her. You know what? Actually, no, I'm not. I lied. Okay. Uh, we're going to use the other two to cast Dependency. What is that? A Enchanted creature gets minus two, minus zero, and when it's put into a graveyard from play, return to his hand. Okay. Now we're going to try and equip. Okay. Move to combat. We're going to swing five at, in the air at the spark double no at the original the fairy for what it's worth the original to fairy being in the graveyard there's some things i can do oh, yeah, but right. the original to fairy to stay alive means i can tap him for yeah. the honor one we're, we're gonna hit the spark double we're hitting the spark double and then this one's going to hit the original to fairy for one i should have done that afterwards but like i thought about it in the moment and i didn't want to take it back that's fine okay Wee. we're going to move to my end step i'm going to sacrifice Despond despondency you can sacrifice an enchantment or take two. I'll take two. Yeah, I, I do not have an enchantment. All right, I'll draw three and return despondency to my hand. Go ahead. Do -do 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 we untap, we upkeep, we draw. We are going to think about our life choices and die. We're going to play a rugged prairie as land for turn. And then we are going to just try. concede. No, I I don't want to yet. We're going to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We're gonna minus three. Guff. I'm gonna deal. Right? His name's Guff. 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 <laughs> Each of you take two. I draw two. Rude. We. That doesn't help me. It's kind of weird being at 12 life and having never been attacked. <laughs> yeah, I'm just I'm just slowly dying, just existing. Oh, you attack once, you attack 10 or something. Oh, like that. that's right, you yeah. fucker. Yeah, you're, you're right. sick fuck. Yeah, I know. But still, that's a lot of life to lose for just only being attacked once. I was just, you know, I was spreading around a love. How, how dare you point at my life total directly? Ticking them up. Put one into my hand and the other at the bottom of my library. I think that's the first time I've ever seen Teferi tick up. <laughs> usually he just minuses and then we, uh, usually I'm scooping my cards up afterwards. Everything, everything goes dark. <laughs> yeah. I start scooping up my cards and start playing another game. Do you wish to continue? <laughs> <laughs> I have picked a card. Is it a good card? Doesn't look like it. It's very silly. We're going to have a good time. Uh, clone your honor worn paddle. My honor worn paddle. That thing's a paddle. <laughs> that's, oh. that's for spanking. It's for Haley. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I am then going to tap uh, for fucking 
the, the shuku and let's get a uh, fucking this tap why not and let's tap our guff that's funny untap the shuku and tap it again here's ikermore gauntlet oh that's pretty cool what that do uh my planeswalkers now have extra abilities uh planeswalkers you control have zero proliferate and minus 12 take an extra turn after this one wow right pretty Crazy. cool whenever you cast a non-creature spell and then whenever i cast a non-creature spell shit happens you put a counter on the thing you can proliferate mm -hmm. go for one thing it's really fucking cool. Uh, then we're going to move to end step. Forgot to do this last turn. Um, so you're going to go to combat? Yeah, I'm going to combat. I think it'd be neat if you didn't have that. So we're going to do something about it. I'm going to cast Artifact Mutation. Destroy target artifact. It can't be regenerated. I'm going to create X one ones where X is the CMC of that permanent. I'm going to cast an offer you can't refuse. Hell yeah, I'll take the treasures. Take some treasures. Uh, trigger this oh, yeah. guy. By the way, you guys got to draw for our hand I drew mine too. <gasps> I didn't! You drew one. It changes nothing. <laughs> <laughs> it changes everything. It was a land chat. Uh, you get two treasures. You're happy with that? Uh, yeah. Uh, I put a counter also on something. I do like a pseudo proliferate. That's cool. What kind of counter? A, a, a counter that is on the permanent. Okay, so you proliferate uh, an object. An well, object. We're still, um, I guess now we can go to your end step. Well, to put a counter on an object, we'll put the counter on uh, you. That seems cool. And there we go. Now we'll go to my end step, trigger guff, put a counter here. Sure, that's, that's all fine and well. Um, I'm gonna secure the sand, the wastes. I'm gonna secure make, the sand. I'm gonna make a sand. one, two, three, four, five, six, uh, one ones. Mm. Yes, 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 that could be a problem. Yeah, what? Fine. No. Um, I thought about it, everyone. Have fun. Fairy protection. Tight. I'm out of here. <laughs> Fuck this noise. This thing, we're gonna put it on. He was at five. Now he's on six. Hmm. I don't like that. Uh, bye. Have fun, guys. I'll get your tokens. Give me my, my tokens. Yep. All right. So how do we not die to Calvin? That's. Uh, I'm figuring it out. Yeah. I don't. I mean, maybe I'm dumb and I am dumb, but I don't think he can win the next turn, right? Well, he might be able to take an extra turn next turn. On his turn. Can you get six counters in one turn? Yeah. Oh, maybe. You can probably rub some turns together. <laughs> <laughs> you know, take two turns and rub them together to create fire. All right, so we have we have six bodies now. Calvin doesn't exist, and uh, I'm scared. Holy's at 49. I'm at 12. Also, whatever you attack me with, you're going to have to say, oh, you sacrifice a creature. That's probably fine. That'll be fine. Mm. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I guess let's just exist for now. Let's go white, green, green, white, uh, red, white, green. Sure. I'm sure. I'm sure we can figure it out from here. We go uh, red, white, and then we put the white into the signet to get the green, and then bam, we did it. Yes. Here is Jetmir. Yeah, huzzah. Huzzah. We have seven creatures, so they get plus two, plus zero, vigilance, and trample. Ain't that swell. Ain't that just a kick in the teeth. So I need three more. How do I get three more creatures, everybody? Follow your dreams. Follow your dreams. That's right. I'm going to attempt with vengeance. Um, I'm going to put... So X equals three. And so I'm going to put three one ones with uh, haste on the battlefield. Each opponent may put X one one red elemental creatures tokens with haste on the battlefield. For each player who does, put X... I can do, do that many. So would you like to have three one ones with haste? I'm okay. Would you like to have three one ones with haste? I feel like this would be a bad idea. Probably. No. <laughs> um, I, I, you're so you don't exist. <laughs> Does that target? Uh, it says each opponent, but I only I can only see two right now. Uh, well, no. Here's the thing. Yeah. Um, I like to look at change, and I gain protection from everything. All permanents I control phase out. However, even though he has protection, you can get around it by not targeting him. You didn't target him. You didn't target it, so he can just choose to do so, which I think he is. Okay. Sure. So what's happening? Are they just normal one ones? They're just you just get three one ones, and then I get three more. So now I have twelve one ones. Anyways, here's six more for you. Tight, 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 tight. Now I've got the juice. I'm all sauced up. Um, you don't exist, and I hate it. Ah, uh, creatures you control have plus three, plus zero, 
Trample, Vigilance, and Double Strike. Um, we're going to definitely go to combat, and we're going to attack Chris Fair. with... Um, they're bigger. They're, they double the power doubles. Holy shit. Each combat. Each combat. No fucking way. Yeah. So now there, there, there's six ones with uh, Double Strike, Vigilance, and Trample? You. Oh, yours. Got Mine. it. Mine. Okay, well, I'm still going to send uh, three dudes your way. So I, I want the Monarch. That's fun. Um, fully... It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Two are gonna die. Are you tapped? Yeah. I have a maze of Eth open, but I might want to save it for Chris. I don't know. And when I attack you, what? I have to sacrifice uh, creature? What, Whenever one or more creatures deal combat damage to you, each opponent sacrifices a creature that dealt combat damage to you this turn. Combat. Yeah. Attacking you again. Okay. So that's what, 12 damage? This is uh, These are two, three ones with double trade. So yeah, you've got 12 damage from that. Okay. Uh, I'll block two and kill him. Yeah. I'll take six. Yep, six. I will also take six. Or 12. You have the monarchy. Hell yeah. I'm going to save this maze with potentially with Chris. That makes a lot of sense. I'll move to my end step and get that card. All right. Untap. Upkeep. I'm going to draw, hopefully, a good magic card. That's all right. Uh, we'll play. Did you sacrifice the creatures that attacked me? Yes. One. So I'll play a land. It was a forest. I am going to tap this Microsoft Gardens to have it become a copy of Emerald Medallion. That makes sense. I love it. So now I have two Emerald Medallions. Uh, tap for two. Here's a Beast Whisper. Tap for two. Uh, here's a Galta. I'm oh. gonna draw a card. Holy shit. Uh, tap for two. Is this what uh, Kodama used to be? Yeah. Okay. Uh, I just changed the commander to Gwena. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. Gwena lets you go pretty crazy. And you can still play Kodama in the deck. So tap for two. I'm going to play this Tulberry Stomper. So I'm going to draw... I'm going to go search first. And Well, this is a cast trigger, so I'll draw the card. And then I'll go search for the basic. Which would be here. I'll move to combat. My okay. powers are doubled, but there's no point in swinging. So I'm just gonna pass. I've never heard someone be like so disappointed, be like, I'm double the power of all of my giant monsters. Okay. <laughs> Cause I can't swing. Move to combat, make Galta 24-24. You can't swing this turn though. That's cause she's slow. Here's another swap. She's got heavy feet. She does have heavy feet. <laughs> all right, well, let's start things off with activating four coffers. This time I'm going to add what? One, two, three, four, five. Five mana. Five whole manas. I'm gonna use four of it to cast Incarnation Technique. <laughs> Guy, I think you're honestly my best choice. We're gonna bring this Brood Mass back, probably. Um, or good old Esper Sentinel. Or Moonblast Cleric. Ooh, that could be fun. Yeah, I think it might be Moonblast Cleric. What can I put on top? Probably something gross. There we go. Great, I'm gonna... I mean, for what it's worth, there's now a trigger on the stack that needs to resolve before your two incarnations. Yeah. Uh, we're just gonna do Assemble the Legion, because I love that dumb card. Okay. All right, Assemble. Uh, I still have one floating black for well, but I'm also going to nail five. Yep. yep. Swamp. Swamp. Ivory Tower. God's Eye. And Ugin's Nexus. Oh, here we go. We might see a whiff. Uh, we're going to reanimate Coco Show. Ta-da! All right. Incarnation. Uh, Sam's Desperate Rescue. Bitter Blossom. Opposition Agent. Okay. And Size and Perverter of Truth. We're going to... One more. One more. Oh, you're right. Sorry. Uh, swamp. We're going to reanimate Size and Perverter of Truth because guess what? We have Hilarious. One. We're going to float. We still have a black floating, so we're going to float two more. And we're going to play good old Children. Yeah. That's good. That's. And old. Really bad for you. What is it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'll be at three. Not dead, but. Not dead, but. Very uh, close. We're going to move to my end step. Oh, you can sack the Coco Show. You just yes. die. Oh, okay. <laughs> my electrical can't change. Oh, your electrical can't change. Yeah, 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 never mind. Uh, we're going to sack the Coco Show. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, um, thanks. Well, yeah. You, you, you're just going to lose five and we'll gain ten this time. And then the phrase trigger is sacrifice a creature or take two. Uh, uh, Good job, Moonblast Clark. We'll sack this, you know, we'll I'm, sack this Beast Whisperer. Okay. I don't want to die. I'll sack my token. I actually okay. have a token I can sack. And then the Vatter Reaper gets a counter. Oh, um, why would you say I told you? You're only told can't change. So he can't draw a card. Yeah. Got him. Got him. Fucking got him. 
Um, uh, we're gonna pass the turn. Cool. So what the fuck? Untap, upkeep. Uh, he says I'm gonna lose two to draw two extra cards, right? Yeah, you. you and then for each of those cards, I'm gonna lose two. Yeah. So you're gonna lose two from this, and then four from this, and then one from or two from your normal draw. Already hit two there. Uh, so two more. I'm gonna draw two more cards here, and then this is gonna see all three of those cards and say, "Fucking lose six. Yeah. So you lose six total here, and then lose six. Six total. Like another six now. Yeah. So I'm gonna draw two from the guy, and then one from my normal draw step. Perfect. We Magic the Gathering. How do we fucking not die now? Wouldn't that be fantastic? Wouldn't that be fantastic, guys? It would be. It would be. But I'm scared of. Really, everyone here? Yes. There is a lot of terrifying happening. Here is an <clears throat> island. I think these are the last couple of turns. Yeah, I think a simple region was really stupid. <laughs> I don't think that car is going to do anything this game. I don't think you're going to get to your... I base. just like it. I think you die in your draw stuff. Probably. Because you take six from this and then you take two from your normal draw. Yeah, yeah. Probably yeah, can't yeah, take yeah, an yeah. extra turn because you'll die. Yeah, yeah I'll no. have to get rid of it. I have to, I have to get rid of the stuff. That, that's what I'm shooting for right now. We're good. We're locked in. Uh, we are going to... Calvin has to save me. This adds red to my mana pool. But if he saves you, he probably kills the rest of us. <laughs> yeah. We are trying something. So that adds a red to my mana pool. Uh, that is a colorless, right? Mm -hmm. We need a white uh, and another white. And then we need two more. Like that. Ta -da. We are going to cast the Magic the Gathering card. Board wipe. Board wipe dot deck. <laughs> uh, Eternal Wander. Uh, yeah. The Ickermore Gauntlet trigger when I get to put a counter on a thing. Do a counter on a thing. Here it comes. And we're gonna put a counter uh, on Tefanary. Yep. And then, y yeah, we're gonna minus the Eternal Wanderer. So I think he needs to pick targets first, right? No, there's no targets. Oh, okay. It's, yeah. And it's sacrifice. Uh, so I'm going to use a green, make a green. I'm gonna pay to life. I'm gonna sack these two to give him another counter. So now you have to choose between these two. So what if uh, you have brains? Okay. So it doesn't just straight kill me. And you, you're, so you're not targeting, right? It's not targeting. Okay. Because she has shot. You have braids. You have that guy because he's on the ground. And you can have a 1-1. One -one. I'll have a 1-1 one -one as well. Uh, we are now going to minus uh, Teferi, so he's down to fit, in order to untap a bunch of shit. We'll untap this shit. Then we are going to tap the Eternal Wander in order to untap the Honor Worn Shaku. Uh, so, like, so there's a color, two, three. Is that fair? Sure. Three colorless in my mana pool. It's it ha makes sense. It's happening. I love it. Uh, I'm just a fucking prey the that we tap these away, <laughs> that we draw something to deal with the fact that that's scary. So we haven't activated uh, the Guff yet, right? Yep. So uh, here's Jaius Phoenix. Okay, what does that mean? Uh, flying Haste, uh, whenever it deals combat damage to a player or planeswalker, copy the next loyalty ability I activate this turn. Oh, that's right, Maze of It. This doesn't uh, work. Wah, wah, no! Wah. I can't do that. <laughs> Shit. Everyone should put Maze of It in your deck right now. Fuck! <laughs> Fine. <laughs> Fuck you. Move this over here. Because it was three before. There we go. Because we had three colorless. Here's a Kazmina. Yeah, you we'll did go Kazmina instead. Uh, wizard. We cast a thing. We get to put a counter on. Rock the Kazmina. Rock the Kazmina. We'll put Kazmina. it on the guff, I guess. Calvin doesn't like it. Doom. And then Kazmia says I can minus two and make a two two. That can hopefully block something so I don't fucking die. And when I do that, I draw a card and then I discard a card. Who needs a mountain? Not fucking me. So there we go. Now we will minus three the guff. Oh no. Each of you take four, I'll draw four. Ah. Can we find something? Uh Yeah. <laughs> I One, agree. Two, three, four, five, six. He's on nine. At the very least, we'll make blockers. Uh, so here is, we, we tap that for... 
<笑>ちょっとパカッ。<笑>モナーク。ウォーアンタップ。アップキープ。アンガナドラー。うん。あ、uh,、ウォーパーウォーダー。あ、ヘルズアナドラー、ヘルズアランド、ヘルズアゴースクォーター。ユーブローメイクのランドローズ。アドローメイクのランドローズ。That's actually like the best one you could have made this game. Yeah. Uh, for what is worth, it doesn't matter. I can't swing at anyone. You can ghost quarter the maze of it. I mean, I can, but that doesn't help me. It doesn't do anything. I'd rather him have it, because、uh, I'm not attacking.、Hmm. Uh, I'm simply just gonna cast my. I mean, I'm just gonna cast Gwena, and then. The Gwena costs four. And I guess I'll play this exploration. Nice. And then we'll play another one. Fuck yeah. And then. Move to combat. Hey, it's doubled. <laughs> no pass. Send us home, Foley. Take us out back. I hope you're just staring at all lanes. <laughs>、uh, we're gonna add what? One, two, three, four, five. I'm gonna use two of it. The necromancy? There it is. Yeah.、Uh, here's the poke show again. I bet you're not getting tired of this. <laughs> Stop me if you've seen this one before. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna move to end step and stack the ne- necromancy.、Yeah. Uh, trigger to a poker show. Like We、that? did. Okay. Woo! Yay! That was sweet. That fucked me up. I like poker show. The poker show, poker show is great. I haven't seen that many poker show in like years. I love that. Comment down below if you can't hear us. Comment down below if life is pain.